Hi, I'm Steve Binkley with Carolina Biological Supply Company. And today we're at the Dickerson Farm near Oxford, North Carolina to harvest our genetic corn. These are the ears of corn that will be sold through our catalog to schools and colleges in North America. In our crossing plot at Carolina Biological Supply Company, we make the hand crosses to produce the seed that is planted in a production plot such as we're harvesting today. Earlier in the season, we were hand pollinating this field and today we are harvesting all of this hand pollinations. After we harvest these individual crosses, we're going to husk them and a quality control measure will check in each individual ear and prep it for storage until next spring. And next spring we'll use it in a production plot to produce F2 ears. The production plot is isolated from all other types of corn and these plants are allowed to freely wind pollinate to produce the ears that are sold in our catalog. We have a crew of people from Carolina Biological in the field today harvesting the corn. As you can tell, this is a highly labor intensive uh, process because the ears of corn are so valuable, we can't mechanically harvest them. We expect to get about 9,000 to 12,000 ears per acre from this harvest. So it takes a lot of time, it takes a lot of um, energy, and on a day like today, it takes a lot of sweat. Harvesting is done over the course of several days, and it, it actually takes place several hours during an individual day. We have about 26 people from the company who are out here harvesting the corn today. It's a full team effort. Everyone plays a very critical role in this process. Definitely when you consider the type of environmental conditions that we're working under, it's about 93 degrees out here. So you have to make sure that you're fully hydrated, drinking plenty of water, and of course, replacing any salts that your body is expending out. So we have um, periodic breaks, just enough time to recuperate and to rehydrate our bodies. And then we get right back at it. The corn that's harvested here today will be put on a trailer and hauled back to Carolina Biological Supply Company. And tomorrow we will husk the corn and begin processing it to produce a finished product. The shucking process is also important in processing the corn and it must be done fairly quickly once the corn is harvested because the corn is wet and if we don't get the husk removed, it will begin to spoil. Once it is shucked, the corn will be stacked into crates we will have people go through the crates and grade the corn. They will take out ears that have blemishes, missing kernels and so forth, and put them in one group. And the perfect ears that have no blemishes, no missing kernels, uh, they will go into crates. And those will be the ears that are sold in our catalog.